What is up fellow amigos and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to give you my thoughts and impressions on the brand new Google Keyboard based on the material theme and how you can get it as well. So stay tuned. So when you first look at a keyboard you may think is this some sort of Swift key theme? I mean that's what I thought in the first place. Turns out it's actually the brand new keyboard. Um, so a couple of differences, first of all you notice that the microphone has gone from the bottom to the top and uh, you'll also notice the color scheme has totally changed, it's gone from a blue and a white to more of a green and white that kind of thing. So, but functionality wise it's, uh, it remains the same. So let's uh, do some testing. So I'm gonna say Hey guys, what is up? Now as you can see, the gesture typing is still around, so that's good. Um, it's one of the most useful features, and as well as your predictive text. I think it has improved, I'm not too sure about that, but we'll see. So I said, hey guys, what is up with you? Are uh, not sure if we are not sure that I am going to see you can <laughs> you okay that doesn't make sense at all I'm gonna see you so uh Yeah, so that is a uh, predictive text. It is this is total gibberish. Hey guys, what is up with you? You are not sure if I, can, if we are not sure that I'm going to see you. This is total gibberish. I'm just uh, doing this as a test. But uh, let's take a look at the other features. Okay, so you have your numbers, your symbols, and if you press and hold, you'll notice that it will be giving a bit of a gray kind of. Uh, Key press. Not the biggest fan of it, up, although I'll probably get used to it uh, sooner or later. Because I really miss the blue key press. I just dislike grey on everything. It kind of a bit dull, a bit boring. I don't know, that's just me. So you can also change your language here. So we have the Azerty for Francais. Oh wait, there's no pretty good text. And now uh, we have English. So I think we have English and French. These are the two keyboards I have. Okay, let's test out the predictive text. Using the voice. Wait, so that's voice text. Sorry, my bad. I wonder who's gonna win the World Cup this year? Question mark? As you can see, it works really well. So, uh, your enter key also is here, and that has been more obvious and it has gotten its own color with a circle. Now, material has, um, material uses a lot of very obvious animations, not really subtle, but I can't seem to find, uh, that happening yet mostly because this is just a beta it's not supposed to be out yet but you can get it right now so one last thing i'll show you is the emoji i don't believe anything is new here you still have your good old emoji and uh, it's all colored in as well as the symbols okay so you've seen the google keyword now how are you gonna get it well it's very simple First of all, you want to go into your keyboard set. You want to go into setting. I mean, downloads. It's lagging. Okay, there you go. Tap the download icon. Or now you download by using the first link down below in the description. Now, what you want to do is you want to tap in the Latin IME. Google underscore no root. This is what you want. 
I'm doing the no root version, so if you want a rooted version, I have a link to that in the description below as well. However, you need to flash a zip and all that stuff, it's a bit more cumbersome. I'd rather you do this. So you just tap install, let it install, it's going to take some time. And we're done. So we tap open. And now, as you can see, it will launch um, the normal way. So tap get started and then it will tell you to enable it in the settings. So that's what we want to do, otherwise there's no point. So we just tap keyboard, blah blah blah, okay. Now switch input methods, select the awesome Google keyboard and uh, now that I'm in Google search, right here, you can see that it looks like how it did in, uh, in, in KitKat. So you may be wondering, how do you change it? Well, it's pretty simple. You tap this comma icon, it will change it to settings. Tap on Google Keyboard Settings. Here, scroll all the way down until you see Advanced Settings. Tap that. Uh, and Color Scheme. Select Material. And... There you have it. The new Android 5.0 Material Keyboard. So... Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe and um, share this with your friends. So have a good one guys. See you next time.